Hey guys, it's Kyle Bennett with HardOCP.com, and what we have here today is our new uh, Intel i5 Core 8600K Coffee Lake processor. This one happens to be an engineering sample, um, and what we wanted to see was if our uh, DLID DiMate tool that we used for our previous 7600K DLIDings would work with this. And so what we did was we got out the mics this morning and uh, checked uh, the integrated heat spreader sizes and everything was dead on right there. So as far as being uh, physical dimensions, as far as the physical dimensions go, this uh, CPU is pretty much identical to this one. So what we have found in the past is, is our Skylake tool on our DLID DiMate would work. Uh, we have a slight bit of substrate difference in thickness the coffee lake is actually just a tiny bit thicker than the sky lake but it still fits down in the tool here properly so that shouldn't be an issue so what we're going to do now is uh see if this works and we'll get this together in our tool there we go There. I'll uh, speed through this so you don't have to be bored by it. All right, now that that's done, I can get a tool in here. You can see, let's see if I can get, so you can see the heat spreader right in there. I'm going to try to keep this on camera where we can actually see that pop. And I'm going to be quiet for this so you can hear it when it lets loose, hopefully. Mm Well, I doubt if you saw it move on the film, but I know you heard it. So, now let's uh, open it back up and see if we destroyed anything in the process. Moment of truth. You can see there, let me bring it in a little bit tighter. So you can see, you can see where we've gotten our movement right here, and obviously it's loose. So there you go. There's our first look at what's inside the coffee lake, and of course the. Uh, the Tim with it, which is of course uh, Intel same old crap. We'll get that replaced. So there you go. Now we know that the uh, the DLID DiMate will of course work with uh, Coffee Lake CPUs, and we're going to come back and get this relitted. Uh, it does look. Uh, I would not think that we should not be able to use this to relid as well, but uh, we'll give that a try. I know we had to make uh, room for the shoulders on the last one, which we machined these out right there. Let's see. Yep, look at that. She sits down there perfectly. So we'll be able to use this as a uh, relid tool also. This is Kyle Bennett with Hardo CP.